Hey everybody, welcome back to my brand new Let's Play of Mortal Kombat 9. In the last part, I started off the story mode playing as Johnny Cage, who overall was a fun, fun, just lovable guy, even though he may seem like an egotist. Yes, but he definitely has a good heart. Heart, all things considered. I'm just trying to just this. It. Yeah, this is good enough. So now in this part, we are going to play as Sonya Blade in Special Forces. I just gotta have a good idea. Okay, so left, right, Y, and... Okay, I think I have a good idea. So here we go. So now we're starting off Sonya's chapter as we're going up against Sub-Zero. Character to show off the X rays. Please. So you hit left and right, and you get some nice damage to make you go, ooh! Yet they're still able to get up and fight even after all that. Done. We're leaving. Stand in my way and I'll kick your A challenge. <laughs> no, you will not be the one to challenge Shane so. You want some too? Fine by me. I just love how everybody just makes assumptions about who they're going up against, so the only logical conclusion is to beat their asses when people are trying to help you. Special military forces beating a god of thunder. I... Even after looking at, oh, oh, she managed to get Jax free. Jax, come on, we're out of here. You aided their escape. You allowed them to escape. Ah, <laughs> oh, Raina, God of Thunder, and the excellent resolver of great Move comebacks. It. Move it. That's an order. Oh, so you're in charge now. Special Forces Command, this is Sonia Blade. Where's that evac? Okay. Affirmative. Almost home, soldier. By order of Shang Tsung, no one leaves this island. I don't have time for this. Out of my way. All right. Oh, uh, yeah. There's... This fight introduces one new thing that sadly no other Mortal Kombat game has. On some occasions in the story mode, but also mode in the game, you actually have to go up against two different fighters in a tag match. So in this game, you can actually play up to four players. And honestly, this that's actually one of the reasons why I enjoy Mortal Kombat 9, 
more so than with Mortal Kombat X or Mortal Kombat 11. I mean, I still enjoy Mortal Kombat X, but it sort of took out the tag mode, which is not really much like a tradition. It's more like a traditional one-on-one -on -one fighting game, but at the same time, it's like, I don't know. And on top of that, I haven't really played MK11, even though it's considered is the best Mortal Kombat game ever, which the thing is, I don't really agree because the story mode is honestly really stupid. Stupid. And, and you have to take out both opponents. This isn't the case like other tag is like I know with like Tekken Tag Tournament 2, it's not like that the round ends when you take out one of your opponents. In this game you have to take out both opponents if you're going up against two matches. So like I said, you can have up to four players and, and they each control one character each. Oh, that was so good on my part. Fourteen hits, that was nice. <laughs> sure don't need any more surprises like them. And that won't be the last time we have a tag match in the story mode. Liar. After I get you to base, I'm coming back. Kano's still here somewhere. Your obsession with him is gonna get you killed. I trusted him. Yeah, we all did. I think our ride's here. And there go the extras. No! Damn you! You have a challenger, Kano. Oh. Pretty boy ain't gonna save you this time. Right? Okay, I really wasn't paying attention on my part. Prisoner, but I guess now he's eliminated from the tournament now that Sonya kicked his ass. There she is. Sonya, you all right? Hey, looks like you found him. What's up, Sarge? He's in. Hey, what are you doing? It's okay. He's cool. Jax! Seriously, he's cool. Well, that didn't take Johnny Cage any, any time at all to believe in Raiden after just one chapter. That's amazing. Told you. Turns out he's God. Yeah, because Liu Kang told you. Thank you, Raiden. Gratitude is unnecessary. I have foreseen events, like memories of my future. They lead me to believe that you are all connected to Earthrealm's fate. What have you foreseen? 
In my visions, Shao Kahn becomes invincible. He destroys all life in Earthrealm. We will all die. I believe these flashes are a guide to defeating Shao Kahn, but disrupting the flow of time can have serious consequences. I'm not worried. I bet you can win this thing no problem. Unless directly challenged, I cannot participate. What should we do besides standing around looking pretty? For now, the tournament must run its course. All right, then. We're with you, Raiden. I like how everybody just likes to believe... Oh! I was going to say more, but we're now... Next part, we're going to kick off Chapter 3, where we play as one of the main... Basically, one of the two mascots, the most recognizable characters of the game. The myth, the legend, Scorpion. Where is the Lin Kuei, Sub-Zero? He killed my family and clan. I will have his hand. I know it is you, Kung Lao. The Shaolin monks chose Liu Kang to represent your order in this tournament. I am Liu Kang's equal. That remains to be seen. Watch and see. I accept the challenge. Never mind the Lin Kuei. Now you face a Shaolin. You will regret your impulsiveness. Alright, I think that's going to do for this part. So in the next part, we get to play as one of the two mascot characters of this franchise, Scorpion. See you guys in the next part. Bye.